We're going to fire a bullet into it and see if we can see anything interesting. It's not that usual to use your Sunday lunch as target practice, but anatomically, pigs are a pretty close match to us, which makes them excellent stunt doubles. Three, two, one. Wow, that was loud. Tiny, tiny hole. Did it go through? That's the question. And yes, it did. Yes, it did. For soft targets like flesh, uh, bullets find it very easy just to, to punch their way through. It looks like the 900 mile per hour bullet has ripped a clean line through the pig. But because we can't see what happens on the inside, we're going to fire at some transparent ballistics gel developed by scientists to represent human tissue. All we can see left is this one trail, this cavity that the bullet has left as it's passed through. What the bullet's doing is that it's transferring some of its momentum to the gelatin, and that, that results in a temporary cavity being formed. So that means if you're shot, you're left with this, this hole that we can see, but you've also had internal damage from your flesh kind of expanding and then falling back in on itself. To stand any chance of protecting our soft flesh from a speeding bullet, you'd expect a bulletproof vest to be rock hard, but that isn't always the case. This is light and it's really flexible as well. Well, the reason for that is that this is made of multiple layers of, uh, of Kevlar, which is essentially made from a plastic. And it's a soft, tight body armour. So let's see what it does. Three, two, one. Right, well, look, that's where it went through. You can see it. That's where it struck. Did it stop the bullet? Yes, it did. What a material. What a material, a plastic that can stop bullets. Now, if you think of when you kick a football to a football net, mm -hmm. the, the football net catches the football. Yeah. And that's what the, the Kevlar is doing, except that in this case, the net is very, very strong, and that's what uh, catches the bullet. Although Kevlar is very effective against handgun fire, it's pretty much useless against rifle rounds. Got yeah, two holes gone through. Time to bring out the daddy of all bulletproof vests. So what we've got here, we've got a faceplate, and this faceplate would have a ceramic tile inside. Ceramic? So what, like your kind of plates at home? So not dissimilar. It seems we've upgraded from a football net to a dinner plate, and it's going to have to be some piece of crockery to stop a 2,000 mile per hour rifle bullet. gone about half the way through the ceramic, but it's not come through the back. So that sniper rifle bullet went straight through the Kevlar, but it didn't make it through this. The fact is, there are thousands of different types of ceramic, and the stuff inside the vest is nearly as hard as diamond. As the bullet comes into contact with the ceramic, the energy of the bullet is being spread over that much larger area. So the Kevlar is like a football net catching the ball, Quite. and this is like just putting up a riot shield and it's just right. like bouncing a, like a straight off. That's right, like a big disruptor that it can't, yeah. uh, can't penetrate through. Good stuff. Wow. Pretty impressed with that. Sniper rifle, and you're still going to be alive.